y'all welcome back to my channel so today i am going to be filming a what is on my registry video so i really wanted to do this video because i am a first-time mom so i know that as a first-time mom when i started looking at registering i was literally so confused i was like what are all these things like what do i even need to keep a human alive i just was so lost so a lot of my mom friends helped me out but then i also did a lot of research um for myself just to see what i thought i would need and so now i am um in my third trimester and i'm going to be having my baby next month and i already actually had one baby shower my mom threw me a drive through baby shower which was amazing because we got so many things and so i am super excited to share with you guys what what some of those items are and then just what are other items that I have on my registry I'm gonna have one more baby shower so I know that I'll probably be receiving a little bit more of things that we may be needing so yeah I hope this video is helpful for any first-time moms or if you are expecting and this isn't your first baby then still I mean it might be helpful just to see what other people put on their registry so Let's start off with where I registered at I am currently registered at Target and Amazon so I'm kind of going to go through some of the items that I already received and then um, I'm going to be switching back and forth. I'm not really going to talk about clothes or anything like that because to be honest, I didn't register for any clothes and there's a reason behind it. So I am very picky when it comes to clothes. So I just figured it would be best if I just kind of purchased his clothes myself and to be honest no one gave us clothes like and my mom was like even if you don't register for clothes you're gonna get clothes and I didn't and so um, that's totally okay and I am actually gonna be filming a video of all of the places that I've kind of been shopping for for my little boy I'm into more like neutral colors and things like that so I do want to make that video if you're interested in you're having a little boy stay tuned because that video will be coming soon Okay, so I'm gonna go ahead and start off with um, some of the things that we purchased on our own. So these aren't on our registry, but I wanted to mention them anyway. So our travel system we purchased on our own and our car seat we purchased on our own as well, like back in the spring. So just as a side note, the travel system that we got was the Mockingbird um, stroller and it is so pretty and so cute. If you've never heard of Mockingbird, it's a, I think it's a Canada based company and they are, um super amazing the quality of the stroller is beautiful i'll insert a picture up above it kind of looks like the up a baby um up a baby vista which is the stroller that i really wanted but um i had seen a, a lot of people talking about the mockingbird and so i decided to go with that one because it was a way cheaper option and i'm so glad i did we got the stroller and the bassinet so yeah and that one is sold it's not sold in stores so you have to purchase purchase it directly from their website. So that is the travel system we purchased. And for our car seat, we got the Nuna Pippa. Um, I just had heard so many amazing reviews about that. So um, that is why I don't have any of those items on my registry because we purchased them um, ourselves. So, okay, so the first thing I see are a lot of like um, essentials for bath time and things like that. So I registered for two different, or I think three different types of body washes and um, shampoos and all that because I just don't know what my baby's gonna like. So one of the first things I registered was um, for the Baby Gannix Essential Gift Set. And this one comes with basically everything you need for the first couple of months with them. So like lotion, um, bubble bath, foaming shampoo and body wash, um, the dish soap and bottle soap. Uh, and then this one is the wipes to wipe off like high chairs and all that stuff. And then alcohol free hand sanitizer. I like the Baby Gannix brand because I, we use it at my job. I'm a teacher and that is like one of the brands that we use for like hand sanitizer. So I like that. I also registered for the Mustela. It's like a gift set and Mustela is a little pricey. I'm not going to lie. Like each little thing is like $15, but I have heard really great reviews about it. And they also have a gift set. So the gift set came with the body lotion, the shampoo and the um, like overall like gel for their skin and I really want to try the Mostella first because it has very good clean ingredients so I also um, registered for the Mostella rinse 
cleansing baby micellar water. I thought this was really cool because um, it's basically like if your baby has a blowout or he gets dirty or she he or she gets dirty throughout the day, you can kind of clean them with this micellar water if you don't want to um, give them a bath immediately. So I registered for that. I also registered for some Mommy's Bliss Gripe Water. I heard that this is essential. So I got the nighttime for colic and then just the normal one, which is the um, gripe water for babies with gas, colic, or stomach discomfort. So I registered for both of those just to have them. I also registered for the, this is the Bodrox butt paste. Um, I already have one butt paste, but I thought it would be nice to have like a variation of diaper uh, rash creams just to see like maybe one won't like be good for his skin, so I might need a different one. So that is that for um, kind of like essentials for bath and changing and all of that. Um, I also registered for the Dreft Pure Gentle uh, Fragrance Free um, Detergent. I actually ended up purchasing this myself because I needed to wash his clothes already. So um, yeah, I already got this and I really like how it smells. So. I do recommend it. I don't know. I like don't know if it will be good for my baby because I heard some detergents can make babies like get a rash, but so far I like how it smells. Okay, the next thing I have on here are the Gerber Baby six pack of organic wiggle proof socks. So I have a lot of onesies for my baby that have like the foot foots on them so I don't know how much I'm gonna need socks but I still wanted to have some I already got some for my baby shower so I um I just put more on there because he is going to be born in the fall season so it might be a little cold I know I told you guys I didn't I didn't register for clothes but I did put this on here just like as essentials and it is the Gerber baby organic five pack uh, short sleeve white onesies I thought that it would be good just to have some basic white onesies if you know I can put this in my diaper bag if he has a blowout or if he gets super dirty I can just put him in one of these and also I might want to put him in just like a basic onesie if I have him swaddled up so I just put that on there I also registered for the munchkin bright warm wipe warmer so I have heard that babies don't like being changed because they don't like like the coldness of the wipes so I wanted to have a um warm wiper I know a lot of people say that this is not necessary but for me I want it because I just feel like I wouldn't want cold wipes on my butt either so yeah so I do hear that they um make the wipes kind of lose their moisture but we'll see so I have that on there then I also had the diaper genie um on my registry and we actually got it so I just have some diaper genie um inserts for uh, like refills and stuff like that. So I have that on there. I also have the skip and hop wipe clean changing pad and I have it in the color light gray and we actually have it already here at home and I really, really like it. I love that it's not a changing pad that I have to be changing the like a cover for it because no one has time for that and like honestly I hate doing laundry so the least I can avoid doing laundry like the better I know I'm gonna have to obviously be doing a lot of laundry with the baby but I don't want to be changing his diaper uh his changing pad linens all the time so the skip and hop one is really really nice it looks really aesthetically pleasing and yeah I really really like that so we already actually have that on his little um table then I also um, registered for some honest company diapers in the newborn size I just got two boxes of these um, we did get a lot of diapers already but I haven't gotten any newborn ones so I thought it'd be nice to have like two boxes just in case uh, I also registered for the Boone grass countertop drying rack so this is where you kind of put your bottles to dry off um, after you've wash them and sterilize them so I just got it in the white color so it's not like super out there with the green okay so for bottles I actually got a lot of bottles um for my baby shower that I already had I got a lot of Tommy Tippy bottles and a lot of Dr. Brown's bottles and I got one pack of the Como Tomos, which are the bottles that I kind of want to see if he'll take. Um, but I got the three-month size Como Tomo bottles, so I put on here like the smaller 
Komotomos, which are the five ounce ones. So I put these on there just so that I can have a variety of bottles um, because I've heard that babies like, I don't like they, they might like one type of bottle and not like the other. So I just wanted to have a variety of them on there. Then I also put the Graco table to table uh, premier fold seven in one high chair and um, I know that he's not going to need this right now but I figured it'd be nice to put this on there that way if someone gives it to us we will have it ready when he um, needs it and this one is really nice because it has seven different ways that you can use it it could be like a booster seat just a lot of different ways so I, I thought this one was a really good deal um, since you're able to use it in seven different ways so then I got these munchkin formula dispensers I am going to try to breastfeed as long as I possibly can but I know eventually he's probably gonna have to drink formula um, for me my mom like got no breast milk like in at all so my sisters and I all three like were not breastfed because she didn't produce milk so I just want to be prepared just in case that is me as well so I got these little it's just like a little formula thing that you can put in your diaper bag when you have to go somewhere and carry your formula around okay then I also put some silicone bibs on there I thought that those would be good for like when he starts eating solids um I also put the bright stars taggies door jumper and it's one of those little Little things that you put on your door and your baby like jumps up and down and I think that is so cute and like I can just imagine my baby being on there when he's a little older jumping on it and I just think it's so cute so I registered for that in the color gray then I also registered for the Fisher Price Animal Activity Center um, and that's just like a little center that I can put him in once he um, is a little bit older to entertain him a little bit Okay, and then for baby carrying, I have heard so many amazing things about baby carrying and someone actually already got me one baby carrier and I think it was the brand. I'll look at my Amazon one and I'll come back to the brand that I got. But on here on, at Target, I registered for the Moby Classic Wrap um, baby carrier in the color Pearl. I wanted to try just two different ones just to see the difference because the one I got is really nice but and it feels like super soft but it's just really really long and I'm not that tall so I thought that it'd be good to have a different one just in case that one is a little bit too big for me so I registered for that then under like the health and safety kind of um, section I registered for a no contact thermometer let's hope that we like can get one of these because right now with everything that's going on, these are rare. And then I also got the Frida Baby Medi Frida. This is the pacifier medicine um, dispenser. So I thought this would just be good if I ever have to give a medicine that it will be kind of like easier to give it to him because it's like a pacifier and you put it in their mouth and then you dispense the medicine. I also got the Frida Baby 3-in-1 humidifier and diffuser. I feel like this is going to be super important to have in my house because um, currently, so we live in a 724 square foot apartment. Uh, yeah, it's pretty packed in here. And so I know it's going to get stuffy and I just want him to have his humidifier. We're only going to be here for a month and then we're moving, but I still want to have this here for him. He's also going to be born at the end of September. So going into fall. And so I want to have it and I love Frida Baby. So I chose the Frida Baby one. Also, let me know if you would like to see a video on how we have kind of set up our apartment, which is very tiny um, for a newborn. I don't know if that would be something that is interesting to you. Um, we're going to be here, like I said, for about a month, but I wanted everything to be ready and good to go for him for when he comes so I have everything kind of organized a specific way so if that is something you would like to see let me know and I would love to film that um, for you guys okay so the next thing is the Frida baby baby basics kit and this one is the one that comes with the nose Frida the Wendy which is like the gas the gas one um, the Nell Frida and the Derma Frida so it just comes with a lot of things that you are going to basically need so I really really want to get that and then I also registered for the Ryan and Rose cutie tinsels and they I don't know if y'all know who Ryan and Rose is but they make pacifiers and teethers and they have these really cute um, utensils he's not going to need this right now but for when he starts to learn how to use a fork and a spoon I really like these because it makes ha handling like the fork and spoon really easy for kids so I just thought I'd put that on there 
Then I have some wood hangers. It's 24 pack wood hangers. And I think that those would look super cute in his closet when he has a closet. Um, then I also got some um, Cloud Island flannel baby blankets and it's a four pack. I have a lot of blankets that I got for my baby shower, but I just figured that you know, I would probably need more, so I registered for that. And then I got this small security blanket elephant, and it's just something, like, that I can give him when he's, again, a little older, just to, like, soothe him when he maybe is fussing. Then I got one pack of the Swaddle Me Original Swaddles, and these swaddles are the ones that are super easy, like, you put the baby in, and you just kind of Velcro them shut. Um, I have heard really good things about these and have heard that they're a lot easier than, like, the normal swaddles. I still got him other swaddles from Lulu and company, which, oh my gosh, like that company is so cute. And I will show you guys in my like baby boy essentials, like when I show like the clothes, but I got him the cutest swaddles from there and I have them already in my hospital bag. So I will show you guys them also when I show you guys my hospital bag, but I heard that these Swaddle Me Organics are really nice to have. Then for nursing, I registered for the Haka breast pump and that is the one that I hear, like when you're pumping on one side, you can put the Haka on the other to catch any of the excess milk that's coming out of your other boob. Um, and I did not actually register for a breast pump because I got my breast pump through my insurance. So I'm gonna show it to you guys real quick. I have it in this Boone bag. I actually got this at Target and this this bag actually comes with a like on the go, um, what what is this? Like on the go um, breast pump cleaner thing. So like if you are gonna go back to work and you're uh, and you're pumping, this would be a really nice thing to kind of have and clean your breast pump out and have it laying um, maybe like in your office or something. And then when you're ready to go home, you can just like close this up and then pack it up whenever you're done. This was only like $6, so I thought that that was really nice and it came with this bag. So the breast pump that I have is the Amita Maya Joy and I was able to get this through my insurance. So if you guys have health insurance, you might wanna look into seeing if your health insurance will send you um, a breast pump. I was able to choose from a variety of different brands of breast pumps, but I just thought this one was the best one because it's just so compact and it even has like some sort of like a massaging uh, technique on this, but I liked it because it was small. I plan on going back to work after 12 weeks, so I wanted to have something that I could bring with me to my job. They also, um, it also came with the little bottles and then um, different sized cups for your breast. And so that way you can figure out which one fits your breast the best. So that is my breast pump, but I thought that I would also get the Haka just for when I want to put it on the other um, breast to catch any excess milk. Okay, so moving on to toys and books, I just have some, like I have a stroller um, little hook and it's from Skip and Hop just to put on his stroller. I also have Sophia the Giraffe Teether. I've heard a lot of good things about Sophia the Giraffe too, so I wanted to pick that up for when he starts teething. Um, then I also have the Baby Shusher Sleep Soother Sound Machine. I have heard really amazing things about this thing. And apparently all it does is like plays this like shh, shh, shh sound. But apparently babies love it. And so I wanted to pick that up to just kind of have like if I'm out or um, he like if we're not at home so he could have a little sound machine. Then I also um, registered for some uh, Dapple All-Purpose Lavender Baby Wipes just to be able to kind of clean around my house and I actually already have them. So those are the little wipes that I use to clean the surface of anything around like where he's going to be. And then I also registered for the Honest Company's Calming Shampoo and Lotion Bundle. Like I said, I wanted to try three different uh, variations of shampoos and conditioners just to see what he likes best. Um, and then other things I'm gonna show you, I actually already have. Um, so I'll insert pictures up here cause I don't wanna like go and get them because they're already on his table. But one of the things that we registered for and got at our baby shower was the Hatch sound machine. And let me tell you something, my husband and I, like, we already have it hooked up and we use it every single night. It is so soothing and calming and I, like, can understand why people love that machine so much. I love that I can control it from the app. So, um, it has, 
an app that you can use on your phone and I already have it programmed to his machine. Um, and then basically you can kind of change the colors of the sound machine. You can change the different sounds and you can also do um, where you program his um, time to wake up, nap time and bedtime. That way it, the machine kind of knows when to turn on. Like if it's his nap time and he has a certain sound that he likes listening to, then the machine automatically just turns on. I also really like it that it's just touch screen. So like if I need to wake up to go change him, I have it on his changing um, table and I can just kind of push it and it will light up the room without like me having to turn on all the lights. So I really, really like the hatch machine and I really recommend it if you even like struggle with sleeping, it's really, really nice. Okay, the other thing that we registered for was the boppy and we actually got it. So I already have it right here. We just have the one that has the little zoo animals on it. So I heard really good things about the boppy as well. So I plan on using that for like nursing and I'm gonna take it with me to the hospital as well. But the bobby pillow is definitely on, I feel like everyone's registry and I will see if we use it. I, I don't know. I don't know how um, convenient it's gonna be, but I thought, why not since everyone else has it on their registry too. Okay, so not only did we register for the Boppy nursing pillow, I also registered for the um, Boppy original newborn lounger and we actually got that as well. I really liked this one. I felt like this one was really nice because it was just a place where I could put my baby to lounge like if we're on the bed or just, you know, anywhere I can just have him there with me. So I love that one and I feel like I'm gonna use that one a little bit more. The boppy I feel like I'm gonna use more like for nursing and maybe I've seen people use it for like when babies need to have tummy time. So I'm excited to have those two. Okay, so the next things aren't actually from Amazon or from Target, but I wanted to mention them really quickly before I forget. So I actually had registered for a bottle warmer from the brand a Avent, I believe, but I actually ended up returning it because we got the, um, the Baby Breeza Pro Advanced Formula Mixer. This machine is basically like a little Keurig for formula. So I was so excited when we got this product. So I was like, well, I don't need to have a bottle warmer at home because this already dispenses the formula out like at like a warm temperature. And then you can also get like warm water out of the dispenser as well. So I'm so excited to use this, but I knew that I didn't need a bottle warmer at home. So what I ended up doing was I ended up finding this company on Instagram called um, The Baby's Brew and they are a company that make this cute little machine that is a portable bottle warmer. So I wanted to pick this up because I thought this would be great to just put in my diaper bag when we're out on the go and I would always have something to warm my baby's bottle with. So I love this, it is so cute. It has these cute little bunny ears on top and then you just pop this off and then you put your bottle on here. Um, and now you do have to get certain um, adapters for certain bottles. For example, the Komotomo and the Tommy Tippy. I had to get little adapters for those bottles but there are other bottles that you can use that you don't need an adapter for at all. So the adapters cost $10 each um, but this little thing I believe was like $60 and I already tested it out and it works really really well it comes with four different settings of uh, temperatures so you can do let me see you can do 80 98 103 or 110 and so it also is really nice because this is a rechargeable product so you don't have to put like batteries in or anything and it's wireless you just have to charge it so i really really liked this and i'm so glad that i got it okay the next thing that i had on my registry that i got was my fawn design a diaper bag so I ended up getting this diaper bag a long time ago, but this was on my registry, but I ended up buying it myself because there was a sell and I was like, I just wanna take advantage of it and pick it up myself. I actually did a video reviewing this diaper bag and seeing what fits inside of it and everything. But yeah, this is just my diaper bag and I already have it all stuffed with the baby's things. So I plan on doing a video um, talking all about what I am bringing to the hospital with him. But yeah, I just wanted to include that diaper bag because it was on my registry, but I just ended up buying it for myself. Okay, moving on to some of the things that I have on Amazon. Some of the things are kind of repeat, so I'm just gonna go through them pretty quickly. Okay, so on my Amazon registry, I have the Angel Care Baby Bath Support, and it's just a little bathtub that we can use to um, give him a bath on in the shower. 
I also have the Blooming Bath Lotus, which is like a little flower, and I'll insert pictures of all these things up above, that you can use to give your baby a bath in your sink. So I have that. Then we also got the Skip Hop Moby Bath Rinse, and it's just a little cup that we can use to rinse him. For bedding, I actually already have my crib. It's all set up and everything, and I have these crib sheets that I got from Target, but I wanted to get another pack of crib sheets just in case he has a blowout or he pees on them or anything because he actually isn't going to sleep in a bassinet. He's going to sleep um, right next to us but in his crib already. So um, I have two... Uh, crib sheets and they come in a pack they're from the company ellie's and amp and i really like this company i ordered some swaddles from them and i really 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 like them so i just have that then i have a olivia and co swaddle blanket and hat and i actually already got it and i'll show you guys what it looks like but it's this beautiful navy swaddle it is so so soft and it came with a little hat i have it in here somewhere but i'm gonna bring this to the hospital to take some pictures so this is already in his baby bag but this swaddle is such good quality so um if you're looking for good quality swaddles i would definitely check this company out and they're pretty affordable then i just have another black swaddle um just like a normal black swaddle then i have a little ones pad pack and play crib mattress so we actually got the pack and play for our baby shower but it just doesn't have a mattress on there so i just put that on there i also got the graco um crib mattress from my best friend so that is already on his crib and everything so that was so sweet of her to get for us because we really needed it but yeah we got we registered for the graco one so um, it had pretty good reviews on Amazon, so I thought it would be a good one to have. Then I registered for just a little mirror for our car so that I can see what he's doing when we're driving. Um, and then I also have, oh, I also got registered for some Boppy pillow covers because I'm not going to lie, when I opened my Boppy, the, the material of that Boppy like a uh, cover is not my favorite it's kind of hard so i registered for some like organic ones just so that they would maybe be a little bit softer i also registered for uh this munchkin portable uv uh sterilizer for the passies i am going to try and give my baby passies and if he takes them i will be so happy because those things are lifesavers, but i wanted something that would sterilize it so it's just a little portable you know uh, sterilizer for that then I um, registered for a variety of binkies. And so I have the Bips ones because I've heard really good things about them. I also registered for some Itsy Ritzy ones, the Ryan and Rose. And I also have some Mam ones. And um, I have the ones that have the little animals on the end. So I already got those. I just, I really do want to try the Bips ones though because I've heard really good things about those as well. Then I just have some baby bandana bibs. So we already got a lot of the baby bandanas, um, but I wanted just to have a little bit more. So I registered for some of those. And also I think babies look so cute in the like bandana type of bibs. So I just think those are so cute. Okay, then I have like some bottle brush and nipple cleaner. Like it's just like a little um, sponge and I already actually have that. So, oh, the ones that I, the, the pasties I was talking about are called the Wub and Ups. So I have one Wub and Up. Um, and then I also registered for some pacifier clip holders. I, um, this brand is called Mushy, but I also got him one from um, Etsy that has his name on it. And I guess I can show it to you guys. Um, this is all stuff that's going to go in his um, diaper bag, but... I got him these really cute pacifier clips. This one is from Etsy and it just says his name on it and it is attached to an itsy ritzy pacifier. Um, and then I also got these other pacifier clips from Amazon as well and these came in a little two pack. Okay, then I also registered for the Philips Avent 3-in-1 Electric Steam Sterilizer and I actually already got this and I used it to sterilize all his bottles and pacifiers and it was super easy to use. So I really, really liked that. Um, 
Then, oh, I also registered for this really cool thing that my friend told me about. It's called the Binksy Baby Shopping Cart, and it's like a hammock that you put in your shopping cart, and you just kind of put your baby in there, and you're able to shop around, and they're just laying in there, and I heard that it's easier to have them in that than in like their car seat or in the actual just like shopping cart. Now, I don't even know when we're going to go to this store because of all the things that are happening right now in our world. So, um, but I just thought it would be nice to have. And then I also registered for the Baby Bjorn Bouncer and I've heard really good things about this as well. If we don't get this, I'm okay with it because it's kind of expensive. So I don't know, um, but I just thought I'd put it on there. Then I also got a baby nail trimmer and it's like an electric baby nail trimmer because I'm like terrified to cut his nails. Uh, I also registered for the Frida Baby Breathe Easy kit and it's like the sick day kit. And it comes with a bunch of things that are going to help you if you have a sick baby. Then I also wanted to register for the Chai Bello four piece um, wooden baby hairbrush. Currently my baby is bald, um, so I don't even know if he's gonna have hair. But if he does, I wanna have a hairbrush to brush his hair. Okay, so the last couple of things are I registered for some baby birth cloth, baby burp cloths from Copper and Pearl, and then um, also from Bird's Bees. I got a couple for my baby shower, but I just wanted to have a little bit more just in case. Um, this is for nursing purposes. Um, it's called the M Design Storage Organizer Container Bins, and it's basically like a little bin where you can put your um, frozen or like your breast milk if you're gonna freeze it. And then I got a cup holder for our stroller because it does not come with one. Um, and then I just ordered a bunch of the Harry Potter graphic novels because I want to have a lot of books for him. I already have some um, that we've received or that I've purchased, but I really wanna have the graphic novel Harry Potters for him. And then I I have a whole bunch of different books on here, but I'm not gonna go through all that. And then I have the Milk Snob um, cover for the car seat. I thought that would come in handy. And then we also, per uh, we also put on here the Graco Pack and Play, which we already got, and we are so grateful for that. Okay, so the next couple of things are things that we actually already have. So we got these things for our baby shower, but I wanted to share them with you guys. Um, this, First item is a tummy time prop and play and it's from Bright Stars. I believe it's from Target and it's just a little activity center where he can do um, tummy time when he is born. So another item we got was the Fisher Price Deluxe Kick and Play Piano Gym. This one's really nice because it's an item that he's going to use um, like as a newborn. He can use it for tummy time but also as he gets older. So that one was really nice. We also got this Summer Deluxe Super Seat and it's three products in one. It's super cute. It's like a little booster seat and activity center. And then as he gets older, he can use it in three different ways. So I'll insert the picture of that because um, it's actually really cute. My sister got it for us. I think that is everything. I, yeah. I think that's everything. We um, also got a lot of diapers, like I said, and wipes, but I didn't include that in here, but it is good to register for diapers and wipes. Um, and yeah, I think that is everything, guys. That is all the things that I have on my registry. Some of the items, like I said, I already got from my first baby shower that my mom threw me, and I am so grateful for everyone who has gifted us anything. Um, we are just so grateful for all of the gifts that we've gotten, but yeah, that's everything that I have on my baby registry. Obviously, I know that I'm not gonna get all of those things, but I just wanted to include them so that I know what some of, those th some of the things that I may need are, and then if someone wants to give them to us, then they, I mean, most certainly can. So. So that is it for this video, guys. If you found this video helpful, make sure to like the video and subscribe to my channel. I make new videos every single Wednesday and I would love for you to subscribe. I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.